I've put in a lot of hard work, and I do have a lot of work ahead of me for the new generations. That's what I want. I have a good, big purpose in my life, and that's what I'm going to put my, my effort on. Ilya. <laughs> Ilya, over here. Um, you've been calling out Conor McGregor. Dana White said very unlikely Conor fights at 145, if he even fights again. Because and who said that I, I want to fight him at 145? Where, where do you want to fight him? Without any weight limit. There is no weight if I fight him. He can choose it. Ooh. I give him that, that option. If he feels that he's ready for this level of competition, he can choose the weight. Ah, thank you. And also... I choose the place. <laughs> <laughs> also, uh, after you... You swiped the belt from old man Volkanovsky Thursday at the press conference. How does it feel to know that's actually yours? It feels amazing, man. It feels, it feels great. I can't even explain it. You have to live it. Felicidades. Gracias. Muchísimas gracias. Te lo agradezco. Ilya, has pedido a Conor McGregor después de proclamarte campeón. ¿Por qué quieres a enfrentarte a él? And follow up on Conor McGregor. You have asked for Conor McGregor after being a champion. Why Conor McGregor? Porque como que Conor representa el, el último capítulo de las MMAs, ¿no? Entonces, para cerrar ya el capítulo y dejarlo en el olvido, es la pelea que yo veo en mi mente, ¿no? Because Conor representa el último capítulo en in, in MMA, so en order to actually go through that last chapter and leave him behind uh, and forgotten, that's it. That's why I need to go.